I'm Larry Carver and I'll be your instructor for this section of Technology in Society. I hope to have uh, for each lesson a video introduction of the material that we're going to cover. Now I'm, re I'm retired, I don't have a classroom to record these videos in, so what I've done is I set up a little, little studio in my garage. I used to refer to these as my garage lectures. But uh, as I've done this for a few years, I've gotten a little bit more sophisticated. And, uh, but I still use the garage. So the stuff you see hanging here is regular stuff uh, in my garage. Now, this course is going to cover how technology has changed over time. Now, to emphasize that, let me show you what would consider to be high-tech for the Vikings or maybe even back into the Stone Age. You know, this axe was considered high-tech. Before that, they may have been using stones or spears, but someone came up with the idea to take the stone and tie it on a stick and uh, it became a club. And then somebody said, well, if we sharpen this, it becomes a little bit more dangerous. And that's how we have, have moved to things like the axe. Now, we certainly moved beyond that in, in technology. And uh, the Vikings are a thing of the past. And I just get to have these things because I like them. But that technology has, has evolved over time. And that's not the only technology that's evolved. I have a cell phone. and It does all kinds of fancy things. Back when I was in graduate school the second time, I was uh, studying uh, for a master's degree in economics and I needed to have a calculator. So I got one that did all kinds of fancy things and paid at that time a lot of money for it. I actually paid less money for this phone and it has a calculator built into it that does more than that calculator I spent a lot of money on. Technology not only evolves, but it gets cheaper. Take, for example, a computer. At one time, computers were large desktop things. And not everybody had one in their home. But they started getting smaller and smaller and cheaper and cheaper. Now, there are people who are probably in this class who are carrying laptop computers. And we've even gone a step beyond laptop com laptops where now a lot of students are carrying iPads. And they'll get cheaper and more companies will start making that type of technology. You see, technology not, all, not only evolves, but it tends a lot of times to get less expensive. And it has more whistles and bells built into it. The textbook refers to facial recognition. That was something that initially was available for police. They had cameras up on streets so they could look for people. They had them in airports so they could see who was coming and going on, uh, on airplanes. Well, facial recognition is now available on Facebook. It's available for no people. So over this course of the semester, you're going to find out in a lot of different areas of our life how technology has changed but not only how it's changed but the depth of technology and the difference that it makes in our society. So I hope you enjoy the course. If you have any questions you feel free to call me or to drop me an email. I try to respond to emails within 24 hours but I want you to feel that just because we're at a distance that I'm not distant from you. So until next week and week two video, I'm saying see ya.